We are of the opinion that the well-lived life is one that allows for rest and peace of mind. We at the same day delivery are here to serve you. So call us to run your deliveries at super fast speed within Lagos on the same day for as low as 500 Naira. To experience our real-time tracking, pick up and drop off services, errand services and lots more. Call us today on 090-6000-8220 or visit www.thesameday.com. Same day. Speed delivery. I am Dr. Stanley Ajo. Uh, I run a group of companies called the uh, Stretchard Group, where we have uh, Stretchard Board Exchange, which basically for exchange of currencies, especially the main currencies in the world. Also, have the exclusive render for which is into logistics. Then we have uh, straight out finance, which is basically for uh, investment um, of our group. Then we have descended delivery, which is a Korea company that delivers items within 24 hours. Also, we have stretch out exclusive renderable, which basically import um, ceramics. If any home that has a ceramic plate or cup, just turn it upside down. And you can see the name there. So you see the name, exclusive. That's our product. These are all we run on the stretch out group. I uh, started my career with Fidelity Bank where I worked for a few years and left Fidelity to Continental Trust Bank. From Continental Trust Bank I left for First Bank. In fact, in total I worked in eight banks before I left the industry. Uh, something basically happened within that period. Uh, I've seen myself being a manager who handles a branch that's not doing well and uh, have my strategies. A really short period of time, such a branch became profit-making branch. So it became my core competence. So any bank I found myself, they always send me to a branch that's not doing well. And within a couple of months, I turn it around. So my name then becomes a magician. But it's not magical. It's just looking inwards and know why the branch is not making profit. You'll be able to identify it and correct it. And there you go. The whole figure changes. But I left the industry because uh, I could see when you're doing well, they give you more work. Why your colleague in the same position are still receiving the same salary with you? So one day I woke up to my executive director. I said, I have been working hard and they are increasing my budget. I meet it, they increase my budget. The highest thing they can do is to give me promotion. So can we strike a deal? Let me run a branch and we'll be paid in commission instead of salary. That will enable me to put all my energy and make the profit times two. The man fell back to his seat and laughed. He said, it's never been done in the industry. And it's not possible. The MD will not agree with him. The board will not agree with him. I said, just give it a try. He said, no, no, no. He can't even suggest it. So after going through that discussion, I said, it's a high time I left the industry to run my own business where I can be responsible for everything that happens in my business. In fact, that's one of the major reasons I left the industry to start off my own company. But I tell you one thing. Uh, when I started as a banker, uh, my promotion was so rapid because at the fourth year of being in the industry, I became a branch manager because I always focus on the job. And that's why I tell the younger ones, 
focus on the job know why you leave your house every morning to go to work not to talk not to discuss but to face the reality that brought you to that institution there are so many challenges in nigeria but i, I advise people if you're looking at challenges you will not forge ahead in life in fact challenges will help you to run a business with that challenge you it, it, it may not operate like a human being because a challenge will, will put you on toes for you to think outside the bus then you'll be able to come up with solutions and when you come up with solution what it involves you are satisfying some people which invariably money will come into your pocket so when i tell people that don't look at challenges look at challenges as part of the life part of life or part of business and that is where you can make it you can't just go to work everything is easy you come back uh, you will not move ahead developed countries that have made it they are trying to solve problems it's when you solve problems you make money so in nigeria a lot of, a lot of problems and those problems are look at it as investment i look at it as businesses behind it funds are lying behind it so if you overcome a challenge money comes in so i don't look at challenge i advise all business people in nigeria whether it is a power problem whether it's road network whether it's a government not providing uh, adequate uh, playing ground for businesses if you continue to look at those things you will not even come out from your house life even to sleep is a risk we can hear that somebody slept and did not wake up does it mean that you will not go to sleep you can hear that somebody had an accident and died does it mean that you will not drive your car so those things are challenges are meant for human beings to solve so when you overlook challenges you run, you run your business smooth and the future uh, for my business there are a lot of things uh, i have lined up firstly i only talked about uh, the finance company we also into logistics uh, and logistics involve a lot of things but basically we are our own logistics focus on conveying items from one point to another or conveying commuters from one point to another depending the type of transaction that come to our way also we have a new business we call descended delivery is basically a career company in fact my vision on on the same day delivery uh, he born out of uh, seeing problems people pass through in lagos sometimes you want to go and get an item maybe about 10 kilometers away from you you spend almost four hours trying to get there to pick that thing because of traffic sometimes you see they say you 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 needed something urgently but when you remember traffic you may end up not getting what you want so i got the idea and said can we solve this problem by telling people we run your errands just tell us where you want us to pick up an item or a message for you we will deliver within a short period of time and the only way to do it is to have a smaller vehicle or power bank bike that can do the job smartly so we started the first one week we launched it was we couldn't meet up the demand that tells you that when you identify a problem it's easy to make money 
So we we see that the few bikes we have couldn't even satisfy our customer because a lot of people are come are calling. They want this from this place to this place. They want this from this place, and we started turning down uh, some requests because we cannot say we can do. And end of the day, we are we're not able to do it. That is not good for business. Instead, we tell you that we are will not be able to take it because we have a lot of orders. So that has solved a lot of problems in Lagos. I could, I could remember uh, a wedding. They forgot their wedding ring at home. And for them to drive back to their house to pick the wedding ring, it, it will be a disaster because the wedding ceremony has commenced and the church uh, cannot wait forever so we got a call can we pick go to so, so place and pick uh, a, a ring and can we do it within 30 minutes we say that that's what we are meant for so they gave us the address we went there pick it within 20 minutes we are in, in their church and we are amazed and before uh, the exchange of ring and that and, and that gladdens my heart because the essence of setting up the company is to solve problem when something that is emergency can we deliver that is where the company was set up for another example i could give you young man was traveling i got to airport to check in to enter the airport they say are you traveling say yes can we see your passport and the man discovered that he forgot his passport he, with his luggage, with everything, or he forgot his passport. And going back to his house to pick the passport, it will take him no less than two hours, which means he will miss his flight. You know what it means when you meet, miss international flights? You are not going that day, you are going to pay penalty, you will check due for the next day. So we got a call. Can we go and pick a passport from his house? Yes, within 45 minutes, it was done. Man was amazed. He didn't miss his flight. There was no cause to pay penalty. He was able to meet up his business that he was rushing for. And when you solve such problem, and not the money behind it, you 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 are happy that you are solving problem. You understand that that's 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 the beauty about it. So I'm so passionate about the company, the way it's solving people's problem in Lagos. And the future of the company is, is um, I can say, uh, a lot of things we we'll need to do. I have a lot of ideas uh, which will come across. Now, basically, we are only in Lagos just to test on the, the product. So when we are OK with Lagos, then we have plan to expand, to go beyond Lagos, and from there have a collaboration with some international courier services. Because our aim is deliver the same thing. We don't have warehouse to to keep any item. Our goal is that if you give us an item, we get it the same day. So that's the name: the same day delivery. No room for delay. No room for storage so when you need something urgent the same day you call us that's that's our goal yeah my advice i have for the young entrepreneurs or people that are intending to uh, come in to such industry especially when you're in nigeria i advise you don't Build your company in your mind. First of all, take a step forward. The best way to start a business is to start a business. Not thinking about it, not writing about it. You take a step. Because you continue to look at the challenges, you may not take a step. When you take a step and you see challenges, you solve it, you, you go further. So I advise any person coming up on board. Yes, when we started, it was not easy. To get uh, staff, it's not easy. 
to pay government necessary approval is not easy. But we pass through such a phase. So I advise, don't look at those challenges, don't look at those problems that are insurmountable. They are meant to be solved. So just start off. And when you have some challenges of staff leaving your company or not doing what you, you, you want them to do, uh, some of them may come, their concern is to see the loopholes you have so that they can make the company. Don't be discouraged. You get it right. When you make a mistake, learn from the mistake. Don't live on the mistake. I tell people, when mistake is made, lessons should be learned. Don't dwell on it. Forge ahead. You will not regret it. Nigeria as a whole is a good land for any business. The only thing you need to do, be focused. Be honest about what you are doing. If you say you are going to deliver, please deliver. Don't deliver a wrong product. Just be honest. The money may not come as you think, but you come gradually. But your name is very important. One day they will call you because you have shown people that you are honest in your dealings. That's the hallmark of business. So no matter what other people are doing, be focused. Don't make mistakes. Don't take people for a ride. And don't try to be smart on your customers. Just be real. Just be honest. Do a good product. I tell people how to market a bad product is when you voice it out. But when you have a good product, you talk about it. The product will speak for you. People will stay calm. So relax, be honest, do a good job. You will have clients chasing you, not you chasing a client. That's my advice for the young ones coming up. Yeah, thank you, Platform Media International, for coming all the way from Canada, Vancouver to Lagos, Nigeria, to have this interview with me. I appreciate that. Thank we are of the opinion that the well-lived life is one that allows for rest and peace of mind. We at The Same Day Delivery are here to serve you. So call us to run your deliveries at super fast speed within Lagos on the same day for as low as 500 Naira. To experience our real-time tracking, pick up and drop off services, errand services and lots more. Call us today on 090-6000-8220 or visit www.thesameday.com. Same day. Speed delivery.